it's Megan and we are back for another day of decluttering and overhauling my bedroom. Just standing here with these closed closet doors and like nothing on the floor is a miracle. Like literally I'm so happy and I wanted to show you guys my new shirt I got from Hot Topic. Isn't it so cool? It's like some of the Disney princesses like Polaroids and then the year the movie came out. I just think that's so freaking cool. And my number one goal for today is to go through all of the clothes in my dressers. I have two dressers and I have a crap load of clothes. So if you guys have been watching the previous episodes, you saw me go through all my clothes in my closet. And I just before um, turning on the camera was working over here behind my door. So I have a lot of my like jackets here and I actually put some of them away like my winter ones my fall and winter um, like blazers and like heavier coats so I fit those in to the closet since there's space um, and my bedroom door almost never opens all the way um, because of the stuff behind here and up there I used to hang like my raincoat and scarves and then I don't know if I just don't remember ever like putting on this hook but this hook is down here like at a lower level and so I just put my scarf uh, scarf like hangers these are awesome I got them on Amazon um, so I have two of those that now are lower so it actually like opens the door almost the whole way so I'm just gonna take that down because I don't really need that anymore and also a like thing that I'm gonna try is I took down the hooks I used to have these hooks like on the outside of the doors and um, that just really encouraged me to put clothes on the outside of my closet so if I take down those hooks I shouldn't like hang anything there because I can't hang anything there so I'm gonna try that so I dealt with the jackets I I think I only got rid of one um, I love all of my jackets like I mentioned before jackets and shoes are my favorite things for fashion so I'm gonna leave that as is and then I came over here to my um sunglasses so these are awesome plastic drawers that i bought from m design like i don't know mdesign.com or something like that you can also find them on amazon but i have a crap ton of sunglasses and i have more up here that i need to like put somewhere so i want to order um I think two more of these so then all my sunglasses can fit and hopefully I'll have like room for if I get a few more pairs so I need to order those because like the ones that sit on top usually are the ones I wear the most because I just like throw them there but I really would want all of my sunglasses like in um, the drawers to keep them like nice and not dusty and stuff like that so I'm going to order that I don't know how to organize my hats I just have them here I've had them like this forever um, and then this pile oh my god you guys this pile <laughs> we're not gonna deal with this pile because that pile is all the stuff I have accumulated over the years to move out so like from Marshalls and home goods and stuff like that when I found good deals on like silverware or other things other random stuff that I should have just waited to buy um, I bought it and I used to work at Bed Bath & Beyond so I bought some stuff there before I quit um, to have like the discount so I have like wine glasses <laughs> I know it's insane but it's just how it is because I don't have anywhere to store it so I have that stuff in there like my move out stuff and then I also have all my like seasonal decorations and other bins so that's kind of what this like pile is and I can't really do anything about it like it just kind of is the way it is until I like move out so 
there might be there probably is a better way for me to do this maybe I need to get like another bin or something like that to fit more stuff in um, so it's not like all out in the open but I doubt we're gonna deal with that um, but we are going to deal with all of my clothing so in my dressers, I have like my t-shirts, plain t-shirts, um, graphic t-shirts. Um, I need to make room for this new shirt because I have so many graphic tees and I wear such a small fraction of them, but they all have like sentimental value to me. So it's really hard for me to get rid of graphic tees. It's like ridiculously hard for me to get rid of them and then I have like jeans shorts I should be able to get rid of a lot of shorts because I found that I don't really like the ones that I have like that I bought in the past and the ones that I've been wearing these days are all from Universal Thread at Target they are amazing so I'm probably gonna get rid of like all my other shorts and then over on my other dresser, or in my other dresser, I have like um, workout clothes, which I never work out. Um, I need to, but, uh, and then all my winter stuff. So like my sweaters, sweatshirts, long sleeve shirts. <laughs> I have so much stuff, you guys. And I can definitely, definitely get rid of a lot today. I took all of my bags of stuff to Goodwill last night. It felt amazing. I had three bags of clothes and a huge um, garbage bag and a smaller bag of like housewares. So dropped all that off and so today I'm sure I'll have <laughs> quite a few more bags to donate. So I think we're gonna get started with the graphic shirts because I love the shirt that I'm wearing today and getting like new shirts that I really love hopefully will encourage me to get rid of the ones that I really don't wear. You guys, this is why I have to get rid of a lot because only the ones that are on the top, like not actually in the drawer, like I have to shove in the drawer, these are the only ones I really wear. And then underneath the ones I wear, I have like a lot that are actually folded nicely but the ones that are folded nicely, I never actually wear. So I am going to have to get rid of a lot. I do have some like seasonal ones. Um, oh my gosh, I'm already seeing so many I never want to part ways with. But I am just going to pull all of these out and then we are going to get started. And I know this is gonna be really, really difficult for me. Okay, you guys, so this pile is my keep. Um, I have so many shirts I love, and these are the ones that I can see myself wearing again. Then I have this pile, which is definitely part ways with, so some of these were really hard for me, like um, this Wild Fox shirt. I love what it says, and honestly, could I like frame this? I should. That's what I should do. Like I have a shirt that I love um, that says being a person is getting too complicated time to be a unicorn that I never wear but I love it. So I'm, I actually think I'm going to frame this because I love what it says but it's on the back of this shirt and I can never like appreciate it. So um, and this was expensive because it's Wild Fox. So I'm going to actually keep that. But then I have a bunch that are like, this shirt was when I loved the show Orphan Black. And like, I just don't need that anymore. Stranger Things I like, but I don't really want to wear a shirt of it. I'm going to see if Rachel wants this shirt. She might already have it. And then I have two shirts from the Overwatch Grand Finals. Me and Rachel have gone to both. The inaugural one in 2018 in Brooklyn, and then the one last year in Philly. So I love these shirts, but 
like I'm never gonna wear this. So I'm gonna see if she wants these. I have some other shirts that I'm just never gonna wear. Again, another expensive wild fox shirt, but it says official hungover tee. And I bought this for when I was going to Las Vegas, but it's like a tissue t-shirt. So you can't like wear it with anything. So I'm gonna see if I can sell that on Poshmark. Then I have this Riverdale shirt. I stopped watching Riverdale a long time ago, but this was from like a Halloween costume. This shirt is so cute. I love it, but it's just like, I don't know. I just don't like how it fits. So I just have like a bunch of random shirts that I just don't really wear anymore compared to other shirts. And then this one I love, but I um, stained it with makeup. So I need to see if I can get that out because I do really love this shirt. So I'm going to put that in the like hamper and then, I don't know, take Tide pen or bleach or something to it. So um, I want to see if all these can fit back in my drawer. And I try to do like fancy folding methods, but honestly, I just fold them and <laughs> shove them in there. So I don't know what the best way to do it is, but I'm just going to try to have these all fit back in my drawer. All right, you guys, I fit everything in here and I try to do it in like a certain order. So like this column is like random and um, Disney, Harry Potter, and then like seasonal. And then this column is like summary and then TV show shirts. So like my The Office shirts, Queer Eye, um, Netflix and chill, all that kind of stuff. And then this column is music. So I have like my Britney Spears shirts, all my Lady Gaga shirts, Heim, uh, Taylor Swift, Dashboard Confessional, and then me and Rachel's college shirts. So that is how I organize this. I hope I can keep it up. Um, and there is like some little spaces in here. So I have some shirts that are in the like dirty laundry that I'll have to fit in here. So I'll deal with that. But next I'm going to do my plain t-shirts of which I have way, way, way too many. you guys so that is my donation pile and this is my keep pile I kept a lot of them um, my favorite shirts are by Madewell these shirts are the best so I have a bunch of different colors and that I have like some high neck tank tops I love Caslon is another great t-shirt brand um, so I kept most of my shirts um, but plain t-shirts are what I wear like 90% of the time. So I got rid of some that feels good. So hopefully these all fit into my drawer like a little bit nicer. All right, you guys, so this is my final like plain t-shirt drawer. So I put all of my like tank top style shirts on this side. These are all of my Madewell pocket tees and all the different colors. And then this is my like other brands. Um, and then these are more of like my three quarter length um, Henleys and then I have a white shirt like that as well. So I'm going to do my jeans and shorts next, which I think should be pretty easy. So as expected, the jeans and shorts were pretty easy. Most of my shorts that I wear are in the dirty laundry hamper. So I am just keeping two pairs um, that were from my drawer. These are all different leggings that I'm keeping. My favorite ones are the Zella live-in leggings. These are absolutely amazing. But I like the other ones that I have as well. These are like um, faux denim, which like is interesting from time to time. So yeah, I have those and then all of my jeans that I'm keeping. So my favorite jeans are the AG Farah. Um, the Isabelle is also nice for a straight cut. Um, 
but yeah, I have some of those. I want to try on these loft jeans, the um, JLo Super Sculpt Super Skinny is really nice as well from Kohl's, another AG. Um, these ones I love from Ann Taylor Loft, the like olive color. And then I have some from American Eagle and then STS Blue is at Nordstrom and I really, really like them. So I have two of those pairs. So those are all the like bottoms that I'm keeping. Here is my pants drawer. I have all my skinny jeans and then my leggings back there. I tried on the Ann Taylor khakis and jeans and I didn't like the fit. They were really low rise. So I'm um, passing those on. And then my shorts drawer is hilarious. Um, I'm just keeping those. All the rest of the shorts that I like are in the dirty hamper. So they will be placed in here. These four drawers we did, that's like my underwear and socks. And that's like my bras and what else is in there? Like tights and stuff like that. So I'll go through that separately, but yeah, we did this whole dresser, thank God. Whew, okay, you guys, I am ready to take a break. It is exactly noon, so that's a great place for me to stop for now, have a lunch break, and then come back and do my other dresser. So I feel really good. I have a nice pile to donate already, and yeah, so I'm feeling like we'll definitely be able to get through all of my clothes and my dressers today, and like I said, that is my goal for the day. So I'm excited. We're on a good path, getting rid of stuff that I really will not miss at all whatsoever. And yeah, so if you guys are enjoying this series, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!